Pink howlite is another crystal and mineral formation that I have literally fallen in love with. They are unique. They can be darker pink than this and very light. As you can see, there's different colorings and the formations. Let's see what it looks like on its base. You can see there are still some pink halite crystalline forms there. And this one has like a little shelf. And look at how beautiful these are formed. Isn't that gorgeous, the shapes? So these came from the California mine that has been closed for a little over two years now. And you can see some of the darker colors right in there. So this one is actually multicolored. It's light and dark pink. Let's see, what's it look like on the side? You can see a little bit there. And it likes the lace. <laughs> Alrighty then. As with most pink crystals, minerals, and stones, these are for unconditional love, self-love, relationship enhancement, business, colleague, friends, family, significant other. They also will help you with your spiritual path growth and expansion, help you open and explore and develop your intuitive gifts and your metaphysical capabilities. And what does that mean? It's a bunch of fancy words, metaphysical capabilities. We, just because we're in human form and have a body, we often, most of us, are now going a little bit beyond that feeling of this is all there is, this is all I am, and realizing and accepting that our energy extends out farther than what the conscious mind would have you believe is where you end. So your metaphysical capabilities, those are your intuitive gifts, your sensing through energy, seeing, hearing, and have that sense of knowing. Heart chakra healing, this is also known as the stone of purification. When I first saw these at the Denver show in September, I was absolutely delighted because these pink halites were on my list. And you just never know if you're going to find them or find the right ones. They help prevent psychic attack from others. Those unkind thoughts and emotions when people are upset or angry or envious or whatever. Having this near you, and I have one on my desk, right near where I do all of my work. And it helps to filter out because it sets up a shield of love energy, which is awesome. It helps to dissolve old behavior patterns, heals feelings of abandonment, or feelings of having been rejected. You know, we hear people say, don't take it personally. Well, you know, <laughs> if it's aimed at you, it's aimed at you in a very personal way, whether it's just business or not. And having this pink halite near you and sometimes when I've had a particularly stressful or unsettling day, I will put my beautiful pink halite that's near my desk or on my desk on my bedside table so that it can then absorb the negative energy from me and exchange that with its love energy. Give you an idea of just how big these really are. Here's my hand. It's really big. I think, what, four inches from here to the other end and almost as wide. And this one is a little bit larger. Just beautiful. The softness does not convey all of its loving, compassionate energy.